Welcome back. Welcome back, Coco Gang. Hope everyone is doing just terrific. Hope everyone is staying in there, keeping their head up. And today we got a special video, guys. Today we got a special video. But before the video starts, can you guys subscribe? Hit the subscribe button. Leave a like. Uh, so today, it is me and Kylie's three years. It's real crazy. Time just flies, man. Time just flies. It's crazy. I can't believe it's our three years. It's really been a, it's been a fun ride with her. There's been ups and downs, but we always get through it. You know, that's what that's what a relationship's all about. Yes. Yeah, so today we got a very special video because I'm gonna give the fellas. The fellas, some game to how to treat a girl on your anniversary. Kylie's at school right now, so I wanna, I wanna get whatever I'm gonna get before she gets to my house because we're meeting here. So yeah, I'm, I'm probably gonna get her some flowers, maybe write her a poem, see what I come up with, cause we kind of agreed we weren't gonna do the gifts. So first step is getting the flowers. So let me change, cause I can't go to the store like this. But yeah, I'll be back. All right, so I changed. So I changed real quick. This is what I'm gonna wear to our dinner. Something slight, something slight. I'm gonna go to the store. I'm gonna go to the store and get her some flowers. So yeah, meet you guys at the store. I think I'm gonna go with these roses. All right, so here are the flowers I got her. I've gotten her. Real nice, real classy, you know. Can't go wrong with that. So, I got a notebook and pen in here already. So, I might just write the poem in here. See what I could come up with. Uh, let's go. Ooh, boy, let me tell you. I just whipped up some sauce, some freaking heat. Some freaking heat. I want to tell you guys, but I don't know if I should because it's like for me and her. I folded this part so when she opens it up, she'll read the front. And I also put in this so she could open it, see that, read that. And I'm going to, I'm going to leave this stuff right here. I'm gonna leave it right here because when we go to dinner, I'm gonna make her hop in here. And as soon as she comes in, she's gonna see that. So, yeah. What you gotta say? What you gotta say to me and Kylie? Um, feels like, feels like more. <laughs> for, for, I was like, what, three years? I feel like it's already been three years. It's like, it's weird. It's like, it goes. Like three years, that's a while, but once you think about it, it's like that shit flew by. But at the same time, I feel like I've known her forever. That's weird, that's weird. All right, so Kylie just got here. I'm gonna play a prank. Kylie just got here, and I'm about to play a prank. It just like clicked in my head. I'm about to, okay, so she surprised me with like some flowers, right? And I'm about to be like, I didn't get you nothing. So we'll see how this goes. But then I'm gonna surprise her when we get in the car. So, so these are flowers she got me. She got me flowers because I told her the other day that I want some flowers. And she wrote me a note. How cute. Look, Kylie's here. Oh, he looks ugly. Baby. Oh, he looks Yes, I do. She said, she said, I don't care. <laughs> I felt bad. I kept laughing. But I didn't want to keep laughing. But I'm trying to rush her, so I don't feel as bad because I feel real bad. She came in with flowers and candy and a note, and I didn't come in with nothing. She'll see it in the car, so. Look at her. 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 Look at
That is why I love her. She's literally not mad that I didn't get her anything. She probably she probably sees it coming. But she's not acting weird or nothing. She's not mad. The fuck? That's weird. But that's why I love her. She's so pure. Wait, I feel bad. I didn't get you nothing. Why do you feel bad? Who said you weren't? I'm not mad. Why are you mad? We said we weren't. Because you always say you want flowers. Yeah. So I got you your flower thing. Thanks. What a good girlfriend. Nice wifey. Dog. We're about to head out to dinner. Early dinner today. But, uh, yeah, we're about to head out to dinner. How are you feeling, baby? I'm hungry. Me too. Starving. Starve again. <laughs> Did you really think I didn't get you nothing? You're kind of a bad liar. <laughs> you sure? Yeah. Thank you, Boo Boo Bear. Yes. I love you. Show me why I always got these for you. <laughs> Is yeah, I'm artistic. about to because it's so good i think to the fact that you made me a poem is just cute <laughs> you're so cute is it good it's cute baby yeah. all right so we're here at the uh the restaurant and it's this new restaurant down like the street from my house. What is it called? Masoni's, I think. I don't know. Masoni's. It's an Italian restaurant. I've so, heard mixed reviews. I'm skeptical. Yeah, so hopefully it's good. And then we'll record after. We'll we'll talk about our relationship and whatnot. Okay. <laughs> okay. Alright. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. So we're back from the dinner. How it was it? great. It was so how do you feel about us <laughs> being uh, together for three years? Oh, I just <laughs> not me, please. Thank you. Look, I'm very happy Thank for you, for you guys. Me, but... Congratulations on your three years. <laughs> how do you feel about our three years? Do I don't care. <laughs> I'm about to eat my tacos. Okay, uh, we're back. We're back in the house. But yeah, I the dinner was good. So now the fans have been wanting to know a little bit about us. So I just wanna like I guess like a little story time on how we met. This is already on our channel. Go follow our channel. <laughs> we haven't posted in quite a bit, but it's okay. We we'll, we'll be back to it. Hopefully. Eventually. Alright, let's say how we met. I guess mm -hmm. school, kind of? School, yeah. Oh, my shoulder. So, like, we went... We went to the same high school together. For our, our senior year. But we did not talk at all. I, I didn't even, know him. I didn't... I mean, I kind of knew her. But. Okay, first year of, like, college, I was, like, on a soccer team, and I was... It was, like that summer before my first year of college started and I remember like I was still always going out and stuff and I would always see a whole bunch of people and I told a couple of like my close friends that I was gonna try to get with her like I was gonna try to like she was my next mission <laughs> so and then people were like what really and I'm like yeah 
And then I made it happen. I didn't know oh, him man. at the time. Yeah, she did. Like, didn't even know who he was. Nothing about him. Yeah, basically, she was my mission. And I got, like, her Snapchat off of, like, Instagram. And then we started snapping. Then we texted for a little bit. But then she stopped texting me <laughs> because... I didn't know him. Yeah, it was a little, like, dry. But then on Snapchat, I was still persistent. I was still persistent, and I asked if we could, like, hang out. And she said, yeah. And then one night, we went on our first date. It and was... the rest is history. No, 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 not too fast. You got to go into the first date. Because. All of this is on our channel. The story of our first date. It's on go our channel. channel. Kai and Co. Kai and Co. I'll put it. In the description. Ooh. Our first kiss. It's nothing really special. We were just no. on my couch in my living room. Well, on the first date. And he was like sucking my face. You were sucking mine. She was sucking mine. We were sucking. Um, Faces. Ew. Uh, no, we weren't. Do not I was trying to get a first kiss on our first date. But, uh... Mama don't play like that. No, I would've. But we got interrupted. By her friend. Oh, I forgot about that. I would've definitely kissed her. If it wasn't for her friend. I was expecting to go in her house. Don't I was, know why. I was really expecting that. And then we get to her house. And we were talking and it was like building up tension, right? My heart was pumping. It was it was filling with blood. And then oh my God. I see her friend. I'm like, and she's like, oh, she's here already. Oh my God. And I'm like, oh. Because we were talking a lot like, longer than I thought we would. But the rest is history. And now here we are three years later. Thanks. So, yeah. We've been madly in love ever since. Mm -hmm. Not, we're not gonna lie and say it's all been perfect. We've had a lot of ups and downs. But know. we worked through it. Yes, um, you gotta. It's a lot of working through stuff in relationships. It it comes down. Wouldn't you say it comes down to how committed you are? Like if you if you guys if like you both gotta be committed. Yeah, it takes two definitely, and it. It's like sometimes it feels like it would just be easier to like give up or like break up or whatever I feel like a lot of people just resort to that we got a lot of the same like goals future plans so like I don't know and I feel like we've just made a lot of memories that like it'll feel weird if we broke up yeah then, like I wouldn't even know like where to like like how to even yeah I don't know we've just been like us for so long that like yeah, it would be weird doing it with someone else yeah or like how do you even like meet people anymore down in the damn so down in the <laughs> that's how but we we're very similar but very different and i think that also helps us like i feel like our good stuff we're similar in mm -hmm. which is obviously very helpful but we're different enough that like we it keeps it fun it can be, get boring if we're being completely honest you know you're doing the same thing with the same person all the time it's so important to like switch things up yeah definitely because um like we've been dating for like three years so like okay every fall comes around and we're like let's go to the pumpkin patch and we've done that for like what, four years straight? Yeah. We don't even do, like, that crazy stuff. Like, we'll have, like, a picnic at, like, a new place. Or, like, get ice cream one night. Like, just stuff like that to keep it fun rather than... Mm -hmm. Especially when you do see each other so... Well, so much, too. It's important. But also, like, right now we don't see each other as much. So when we do, it's, like, important that we're, like, you know, wow. doing fun stuff. Maybe we'll come back for another video. Talk about... How to keep a relationship spicy. <laughs> spicy? Spicy like a hot tamale. <laughs> well, I do that because I'm a hot tamale. And what am I? 
You're a German schnitzel with soup. <laughs> What's the message of the day? I'll let you do the message of the day. Never right, stop up. adventuring. All right. Right? Yeah. You know, it's, you, like, you should just always try to do something different. Even if it's trying a new restaurant, if it's as big as seeing a new country or a new state or something. Never stop adventuring. Because this world is too big not to exactly, see. Exactly, I was just—you literally took the words out of my mouth, and I feel like, oh, uh, I have—I need to work and all this stuff. True, but you can't take you money to the grave. You—you you really do only live once, and it's yeah. like yeah. And gotta... I feel like a lot of people get caught in that mindset of like, oh, well, like I need to make money and I need to work and blah blah blah. But like, what? You're gonna work the rest of your life. Now is like the time to travel, and I just feel like now especially too like the way the world is like you can make money doing so many things like mm -hmm. online and stuff so take advantage of that and see the world should we make a podcast comment down below if you think we should make a podcast so the message of the day never stop exploring because you only get one life all right guys well thanks for watching hope you enjoyed it it was just something to post but it was a special video for us so Hope you guys liked it. Leave a comment. Like it. And subscribe for us. For us? Go to our channel. Yeah, I'll put, I'll put our <laughs> we'll channel down below. We'll be back with our... new videos soon, I promise. But if we don't, it's because of her. She doesn't make up anything. That's her channel, basically, now. This is my channel, so. Whatever. All right, guys. Peace. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.